Welcome to Nippert Stadium where FC Cincinnati training winding down on Friday afternoon. I'm Tom Glitter, happy to be alongside my broadcast partner Kevin McCloskey as we get you set the orange and blue back in action tomorrow and back here at Nippert Stadium. North Carolina FC will be here. It's a blackout, a 7.30 start tomorrow night. And for head coach Alan Koch, obviously midweek played the Open Cup match against Detroit City, won 4-1. to one. We saw the return of Evan Newton after missing four matches, and now we're going back two months to our conversation in March. Allen's got a tough decision. Who's in goal tomorrow? Is it Spencer Ritchie, who's played the last four, or Evan Newton, who started the first five league matches? Obviously, it's you know Allen's decision, but yeah, it is. It, it's a, a tough decision. Um, we saw, said this last week as well, Tommy. It's a luxury as well to have both Spencer and Evan you know, as choice. Um, I, I thought Evan had a pretty good game the other night. Um, so it, it's going to be a tough decision, but I think you know, whatever decision he makes, I think it'll be a safe choice. Certainly two good choices for Allen Koch at goalkeeper. When we look at Wednesday night, it now means three matches in eight days thanks to that Open Cup win. Some of the older guys, we'll call them, had squad rotation and rest on Wednesday, which means the likes of Deco Kanan, Justin Hoyt, Manuel Ledesma will have fresh legs, Richie Ryan, if called upon to be in the starting 11 tomorrow. Yeah, and again, I think that's a great injection of experience, you know. Um, I felt like, uh, obviously, they did enough to get the win in the Open Cup, and it's always a little bit of a risk when you rotate, um, but coming back in with those players to start on Saturday, I would I would imagine at least, um, is huge, and I think it brings a, a not just experience, but talent as well. North Carolina FC arrives 2-3-2 and two on the season. They've found their form as of late, unbeaten in their last four, 2-0-2. Two, oh and, two. and as I've watched film, certainly seems like a club that's gaining a lot of confidence here moving into the second quarter of the season. They're starting to click, I think. Yeah, I think they had a, a slow start to the season. But mm -hmm. like you said, last four games, they've had, you know, unbeating, good results, good performances as well. Um, so they're probably starting to hit stride it with form. Um, but it doesn't matter. You know, I think FC Cincinnati back at home at Nippert Stadium, I, I think have to send a message um, to the league and, and also put on a good performance for the fans. Coming off just their second league loss of the year last Saturday, the Orange and Blue will look to bounce back tomorrow. Again, it's a blackout at 7.30 against North Carolina FC. And good news, broadcast partner Kevin McCloskey does not need old man rest, so he will go for the third time in eight days as well. Kevin, appreciate the time as always. Thanks, Tommy. I appreciate it. That's Kevin McCloskey. We will have the call alongside Lindsey Patterson tomorrow at 7.30. Hope to see you here at Nippert Stadium. Thanks for tuning in.